Hi, my name is Stephen McGee and I'm the author of Toxic Electricity. I'm here to do a review on this particular plant. Now this particular plant has been growing in a Faraday cage and this is the Faraday cage that's been growing in and it's been in there for quite a few months now and it's now starting to show the results of the growth defects that are occurring by being in a very low electromagnetic radiation environment. And this is what the leaves are now looking like. So we've got some very, very glossy leaves. But the thing you'll notice is the leaf colour is very, very light. And I actually have one of my control plants here. This is actually how my control plants deform in the house. Now I actually live very close to cell phone towers. So right now my assumption is this is what cell phone radiation does to this particular plant. I'm still trying to work through the problems that may be causing these growth defects, but all of my control plants deform to this growth that are not exposed to various kinds of electromagnetic radiation experiments that I do. So this is what the plant should normally look like. But as you can see, it's quite different. So the low radiation form of growth on this plant is like this. And it's, uh, it's interesting to see that the, the leaves do actually lose all of the patterning. And they go very, very light green. And we've got some of the original leaves. This is how the plant used to look. And this leaf is going to get dropped probably in the next few months. We've got another one down here. And these leaves are typically the size of your hand. So we can see that these are much smaller. There's another one down here. So I'm going to leave this plant growing in its Faraday cage. Uh, I should mention that this Faraday cage, it's screened, but it's not electrically grounded. So it's just purely blocking out any of the signals that are in its environment. And they're just running around on the mesh. So that's what we've got so far from this plant being inside this cage. So it certainly is showing some stress and it's showing very, very unique growth compared to anything else that I have growing in the home. Hope you enjoyed this presentation and I wish you the very best of health. Thank you.